there are many exercises that one can do with the breath. There's the world of mindfulness, uh, which is using the breath as an anchor for, for getting back into the body, getting back into the moment, getting back into yourself. And then there's breathing exercises like deep breathing, uh, diaphragmatic breathing, prolonged exhalation, the, this world. And the therapist can uh, have control of, decide which of these uh, 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 he is going to prescribe to his client. And he doesn't want to confuse them. And this is something that we learned recently from one of our advisors, who's a, not only a clinical psychologist, he's also um, head of the uh, one of the clinical uh, of the clinical department in Bar Ilan University in Israel. Cool. And he's also a, a researcher. He has a, a big lab for psychopathology, and he studies mindfulness as as a, a, a therapy for different pathologies and also for for non pathological circumstances. For example, uh, p uh, using it with police officers, t teaching mindfulness to police officers who are dealing with the with, uh, uh, daily uh, uh, population that has a lot of conflict. It's actually in the old city of Jerusalem. Mm 